Yesterday, it is warming up for us. It is going to be warm. <laughs> yeah, I know I'll be at the soccer fields later today and already I'm like, okay, need the pop up for the kids to shade them. You need the hat. You need, you know, the sunscreen, the whole deal. Yeah, this is uh, really going to be some warm weather today as temperatures in the valley will be into the middle and even upper 90s in a few locations this afternoon. Certainly our warmest temperatures of the season. 56 right now in Sacramento. It's a great time to be outside. We do have lots of sunshine, clear skies, comfortable conditions, not much wind stirring about. Uh, we have a light north breeze, if anything, coming down the valley. We're at 58 degrees in Stockton. We've got sunshine, calm conditions here too. Getting ready to see those temperatures get back into the 90s today. We've got sunshine to enjoy this morning in Modesto. It's really comfortable, 60 degrees in here too. There's not much wind stirring about this morning. In Fairfield, we're at 55 degrees, just a light on shore breeze that should stay in place throughout the day. The difference will be tomorrow when we wake up. I think we might have some more of those low clouds along the coast and better onshore breeze means temperatures tomorrow will turn a little cooler, not only for the Delta, but probably for the Valley too. We're at 36 though to start this Saturday at Lake Tahoe. What a gorgeous view of all that blue sky. It's going to stay that way throughout the day. Just a light breeze out of the south currently today heading to 98 degrees. Certainly going to be the warmest of the season. All we got to do is get past 93. That's been our warmest day of the year so far. We didn't even make it to 90 yesterday, so so far this May we haven't reached a 90. The average is 81 degrees. Looking at future cast again, we're going to see a lot of sunshine today along the coast. Just a little bit of that light marine layer, maybe a couple of light scattered clouds in the Sierra. That's about it. Just a beautiful day. Tomorrow morning, though, we wake up to a better marine layer. There's a lot more fog in San Francisco. Maybe some high thin clouds sweeping across the Sierra. This is part of a weather system that's off to the east and to the north of us. What that will do by the afternoon, even by noon, one, two, three o'clock, we're going to see a couple of thunderstorms fire. They should be mainly along the crest and the east side, but that means near Tahoe and then they should push off into Nevada. And again, notice the skies clear here in the valley. So here's the Mother's Day forecast for the Bay Area. It'll be windy because that onshore breeze will str really start kicking up tomorrow for Mother's Day. We should make it to around 90, 92 or so in most valley spots tomorrow in the mid 80s for the foothills. And again, that slight chance of a uh, Sierra thunderstorm in the mid afternoon hours. And then this is what it looks like tomorrow afternoon and evening, eight o'clock. We have that good onshore breeze going at that point. It could be pretty gusty in, say, Solano County. So if you have any barbecue plans for Mother's Day late tomorrow, again, that wind is going to really be rather robust. Highs today near 80 degrees on the west slope. Pollock Pines and Arnold, what a beautiful day. We'll be at 87 in Jackson and Grass Valley this afternoon. Pretty warm. We'll also be in the low 90s today in the Delta, but tomorrow we'll only be in the 80s. Today's 94, Modesto 96 in Stockton. We're at 95 in Elk Grove and 96 today in Roosevelt. Now looking at the seven day forecast again, temperatures drop some for Mother's Day. We're only in the upper 80s on Monday and then we'll warm right back up low to mid 90s Tuesday and Wednesday. Looks like we'll even stay near 90 towards the end of the week. Leticia starting to feel like summer. I sure think. is.